guys, welcome back to another YouTube video. And in today's video, we're gonna be taking Gizmo here. Say hi, Gizmo. Say hi, buddy. Just say hi, buddy. We're gonna be taking Gizmo back to squirrel him like we did in the last video. Hopefully, get some squirrels. We're gonna take the side by side to the train tracks, and I'll see you guys there. Hey, Gizmo, you want that piece of? Oh, let me break it up for you. This is awesome. It's good stuff, isn't it, boy? It's good stuff. You ready to go? You ready to go? Got his tracking collar on him. Got Gizmo loaded up. I'll catch you guys at the train tracks. We made it to the train tracks. I'm gonna get Gizmo on his leash and we're gonna walk down. I'm gonna turn him loose and we're going we're going we're gonna treat some squirrels, Gizmo, aren't we? Got Gizmo on the leash. I'm gonna walk down, I'm gonna turn him loose. Come here, buddy. Oh hey. Hey. Let me get this leash off of you. Go find a squirrel. I hear him barking. I'm gonna walk in here and check it out. So actually, I didn't. I, I told you I was gonna walk in there because he was barking, but I was back there. But I never actually walked in there because he came back. But he just barked like right, right in front of me over there. Like right over there. I don't see no squirrel in the tree. I, just, I don't know what tree he's barking up, but I don't see no. Hey guys, uh, I don't know if it was Gizmo or not, but way down there at the end, I, like at the end of like where there's a field down there, right on the edge of that field, I swear I just seen a fox squirrel. It was like black, a little black thing. Ran across the train tracks, so like, I don't think it was Gizmo at all. I'm trying to call him back, but on my GPS, it shows him as a question mark, so. I don't know where he's at. Here, Gizmo! So I'm toning him and calling him. So maybe I can get up, go over there and get him on that squirrel. I don't really want to shoot the fox squirrels though, because I've shot like three off these train tracks. But I don't want to shoot no more. Yeah, see, Gizmo's right there. So it was definitely a squirrel. I, I just want to get him on a squirrel. But I don't want to shoot no fox squirrels because I want to let them breed around here. And one day there'll be a bunch. I'll be able to shoot as many as I want. But I've seen I've seen a couple more that I not the ones that I've shot, but I've seen a couple more, so I know they're out here. And I want to let them breed. I think it'd be awesome. So I, I know you can't see it, but Gizmo just ran all the way down there to where I just seen that fox or I seen like a squirrel thing cross. And he, I watched that squirrel run up, or I don't, I didn't watch it run up a tree, but he's like right where it crossed. I know you can't see him, but he's right over there on it, but he's not barking. But he, he, he like, cause he was running along this track. He just stopped, looked over, and ran in there. He either seen it or heard it or something. But he's smelling around that tree that I've seen it go by. Hopefully he'll get on him. So I'm walking over here. He's like jumping on that tree. And I watched that squirrel go by. He's bleeding, not barking. He likes to chew on trees for some reason. So he's kind of like chewing on the tree. I don't know what he's doing. Or why he's not barking. But he's like right here. See him over there. So he just barked like one time. But I mean he's not barking. Uh, he barked one time. 
Dude, there is a, like, this is a cornfield right here. Well, no corn, of course, but there's no corn in the field, but it's old cornfield. Dude, the doves over here are thick. I need to come dove hunting, man. I think my dad has permission to go. Like, I can back behind that field over there. Oh, did you just hear it? Yeah, that's the, that's that tree right there he's on. That I heard that, that I watched that squirrel go by. I don't know if you went up that tree, but... But yeah, I think we have permission to go back in that field. So... That'd be cool if we could come go dove hunting over here. He's starting to bark more and more. I think a squirrel is in this tree. I think he's in that tree. He's in one of these trees. I just need to look for it. Oh my goodness, of course when I start filming, he just like lit up barking on that, on that, on that tree right there. He just lit up like he's seen the thing, dude. And then when I start filming, he just shuts up and comes over here. Normally when he lights up like that, he'll like, he sees the squirrel maybe. Okay, I'm digging. I used to dig for some reason. Here he goes. Look back, look back up again. Oh, tree right there. I don't see the squirrel, but I'm just, I, I, mean, I, I watched the squirrel cross this tree track, so I know he's over there somewhere. He has to be in that tree. He just has to be. This one's him going off. I see the squirrel guys so I was like in the I thought it was in this tree but then I was thinking I was like that dude could be in that tree so I like shot in the tree to see if it would move because I was shooting up that tree he was up right there but I was like he could be in that one I shot up that one and he, now he's in that tree you see him jumping around up there, but it's a fox squirrel. I don't want to shoot him. Gizmo sees the squirrel. Look at it. Look, that's a pretty thing, man. That's awesome, but I don't want to shoot him. I don't want to shoot the fox squirrels. Gizmo wants him, though. He's in this tree right here. This close, this biggest pine tree. Right here. I don't like the point of it right there. Let me sit. So what's up this tree right here? It's in there somewhere. It might have... I lost sight of it. Gizmo did too. It might have went in a den. I mean, I'm not going to shoot him anyway, but... Um, I don't, I don't plan on shooting anyway, but I just want to see if I can. You might have seen him when I was filming just a, just a second ago, but I don't know if you could. I want to see if I can get up there. A good, um, thing is, y'all. Like, good thing is. See, uh. I would want to make some new content because I know my last video was just a squirrel hunting video with Gizmo, but I just need to run Gizmo and I thought, I thought why not make a video out of it because I, like, I don't know what else to do, you know, so I thought I'd film, film this, film a squirrel hunting video, but 
I don't see that fox squirrel. He probably went in a hole in the tree or something like that. I, do, I know there's a nest, like, there's a fussy a squirrel nest. When I was in the woods with you, there's right over there, but I came back out. I don't see it anymore. Oh yeah, I see it though. Hold on. You guys, well, you can't necessarily tell from here, but it's like right there, right, right there. It's behind them branches, like right there. Can't really tell. It's a squirrel nest from right over here. But I'm gonna try to pull Gizmo off this squirrel. I'm on the end of the train tracks, and there's like a house right over there. I don't want to get Gizmo on that man's property. I'm gonna walk down. Walk down more, maybe. Oh, I do need to actually. So last time I was here, when I shot that fox squirrel in the last video, I tied Gizmo up to because my dad came out here and he didn't know where I was at. He didn't know where I was. I was at, so I had to come out here. But I didn't want to lose where the fox squirrel was or where. Like I didn't want Gizmo to run away, so I tied up Gizmo to a tree with the leash so I would know so he'd keep on barking and so I know where the squirrel was at so but my dad untied him from the leash and I I thought he grabbed it but he didn't so I gotta go in there and find the leash somewhere over there but maybe I'll, I'll find it but I'm gonna pull him off the squirrel I think there's that leash right here so that's where I shot the squirrel out of, out of that tree. There's a tree in that tree. I kind of like the big tree. I actually ended up killing him like over on one of them. But I found at least just what matters. What are you doing, dude? What are you doing? It's a good gizmo. Good gizmo. Uh, guys, I think I'm really cold. It's like 30 degrees out here. He just jumped in that, he went to run across that mud, like that water hole, and he just fell through the ice. But, it's really cold, and it's like 3 o'clock, it's like, no, it's, it's 4 o'clock, I've been hunting, wait, it's 4 o'clock, I've been hunting since 2 o'clock, I've been hunting for like 2 hours, which, he's treated a couple, I just ain't walked in there and I've seen him, but, then we'll go back to the house, I'm gonna feed the, all the dogs, so I film that. That's a little extra content for y'all. But I'm gonna load Gizmo up and I'll, I'll catch y'all back in the house. Ooh, I just made it back home. It's it's dry since I got to this like the train tracks. The it's dropped like the temperature has dropped so much. It's so cold out here. The ride home was miserable. I'm gonna get Gizmo in his pen. I think we're both wore out. I don't know. He could probably get some more. I'm going to get him in his pen and I'm going to feed all these dogs. He's whining. Do you want to go back hunting? You want to go back hunting? Got this bucket filled up with dog food. We're going to feed the dogs. Each dog gets about this much dog food. It's not that much, but it's... Enough for them to fill up. There you go, Charlie Brown. This dog just spilled the water in the dog food. I gotta. No, the water trays are so I gotta empty the bucket. So I want her to have as much food as possible. That was like half of what was in her bucket. There you go, Jill. There you go, precious. Pretty good. There you go, Ice Man. Puppies! Puppies! Puppies get just a little bit less than all the regular. Get out your dolphin ball. There's a there's a scoop for Bella. And then there's a scoop for Annie. 
That's Bella. She has the full white neck. Bella has the full white neck. And then Annie has like half of a white neck. So that's Annie. There you go, crazy girl. There you go, Sally. Sally's already tipped her water bucket over. It was covered with ice. She ate one with water. And finally, Rambo. Last of them. He's got plenty of water. Just put the ice in there. Oh, this is big ice, too. It don't never get that cold to freeze. I hope it doesn't get so cold to freeze water over here in North Carolina. So Gizmo already has a little bit of food in here. A little bit of... We're just getting the rest. That's the rest of the dog food. But he already has a little bit in his pen, so... But we're just going to the rest. His water is frozen too. No Gizmo, don't get out. No, you stay in there, buddy. You stay in there. And finally, we gotta feed the pigs. The pigs get corn. I'll throw about two scoops of corn in there for them. Corn is good protein and, you know, whatever for them. And normally you wanna have wet corn for them so they can. My dad just told me that, so I guess they can eat it better, digest it better, something like that. But I just let it sit right here, and right now. it rains a lot, so normally it, it ends up being wet. I'm gonna go to feed water every other dog. I don't know if the water hose might be froze over. I don't know. Nope, it doesn't look like it was. Sometimes it'll get cold enough where it'll, sometimes it doesn't get cold enough where it'll freeze, but sometimes some flaky, walk, flaky ice will come out, but I don't think it did that time. There's water, there's water for Charlie Brown, there's water for Annalie. So, you guys can probably guess, um, but the reason we have these dogs is because uh, we run deer with these dogs. If you don't really know how that works, it, you go, like, we have this big hunt club. It's like 30,000 acres, and there's different blocks, and we turn dogs loose in these blocks of wood, woods, and they run deer out in the paths, and people will just shoot them as they run across, like, shoot the deer as they run across. There's water from Jill. So, oh, there's no dog in that thing. That's the reason we have all these dogs. Not just we have them just because and we keep them locked up in these pens. They get used. They 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 get used for a reason. There's water for precious. I don't think I ever took the ice block out of Ice Man's pen. He's the Ice Man. There's water for the puppies. There's water for Crazy Girl. Allie knocked over her water bucket again. She wants water. I'm giving you some, girl. She's thirsty. But there's water for her. Rambo already had water. And I think Gizmo had still had a little bit in his pen. I think I just took the ice out of his. Gizmo, I man, I think I, I don't know if I said Gizmo or Rambo. But he does. And we gotta have water for the pigs. The pigs are kind of filthy. Yeah. Kind of nasty water, but. Whoa. Almost just fell in. Turn the water off. Well guys, I think that'll be the end of this video. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. And if you will, please smash that like button, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Dixie says bye too.
What did you say about this? Yes, 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 she said bye.